Bill Gowdy checking in. It's time. Yeah, you know what time it is. It's time to get the priority straight. It is time for a vessel of amber fluid. Man, oh man, have I been working hard for this. Just a beautiful, beautiful day. And I'm actually sweating. Can you believe it? Wow, is that good. Man, this video is brought to you by Daddy Hinkles. Daddy Hinkles, it comes in a package of two, it's a marinade. You pour the liquid on and then you sprinkle the powder. We're gonna give it a try. Now this, this video has been a long time in coming. Uh, before I had to go to Florida, Bulldog Bill uh, actually acquired this. I'm gonna insert a little clip right here. You're gonna see a little snow and cold on the ground when he actually brought this down. And now, weeks later, oh, we're talking springtime, buddy. It is nice. Hey, uh, the other day, I was cooking fish, and this lady stopped by, and she ate some fish, and she went out to her car, and she got me this, and I told her I was going to bring it down to uh, uh, Bill Gowdy to uh, cook with. Uh, real nice lady, representing Daddy Honkles Instant Meat Marinade and uh, a liquid and a powder bow. Really? Let me see that. Let me look at that. I've never heard of that. I hadn't either. Oh. But I'll be darned. But with the dis dis distribution of it. So. www. Let's see if I get that in camera. DaddyHinkles.com Well, uh, man, I'm anxious to give that a try. She said it was really good. We're going to do us a little uh, campfire deer steak fajitas. I got some uh, bell peppers and onion and uh, cast iron skillet and uh, I got a deer, big old thick deer steak over there that's been marinating for the last 12 hours or so. And it really uh, doesn't need to marinate that long. Uh, however, uh, I started to marinate it and then uh, something came up and you know what? 12 hours later, here I am. Ready to cook it. So, that seems to be how it works around here. Let's get to cooking, shall we? So what you're gonna need is some, I'm using some sweet bell peppers that were on sale. These are the small little ones. These are excellent for stuffing, but uh, they're excellent for this as well. Uh, I suppose they're, I'll bet they're a product from Mexico. I bet they're from the Mexican garden right now. What do you think? All right, and then, uh, Shredded lettuce. Some uh, I'm using some of the Kojak. Uh, that's a Monterey uh, Colby cheese. Big Bad Brad doesn't uh, really care for uh, heat, so I'm putting the jalapenos on the side. We have the deer steak in the Hinkley's Hinkles marinade, and uh, what you put the liquid on, and then you sprinkle the dust it with the uh, dry powder and let it marinate. And boy, I'll tell you what, it just looks really good right now. And then you're gonna want some tortillas. You got some nice big flour ones. You need, uh, I got onion, I already diced up an onion inside with this, with this is already the onions and peppers. Butter, some olive oil, cast iron skillet, and of course you'll need a nice campfire. Campfire like that will work out just fine. It's getting to be just about right to cook on here. Did I mention that Big Bad Brad's down? He's the one that's supplying the deer meat. Awesome. How many deer did you get this year? Two. Two legal deer. One doe and a buck? Two bucks. Two bucks. Nice. Nice, and we're gonna eat one of them tonight, huh? Yep. Yeah, pretty good. That's a hot fire. Oh yeah. Man, oh man. So I've got some olive oil, and I got some 
about a half a stick of butter and she's a hot 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 fire Gonna keep that off to the side, let it stay warm while these soften up a little. Huh. Oh, what's good? Wish you could smell that. Slice it thin. All right, so now you want to dust your tortillas. You don't want to leave them on there very long, just long enough to soften them up. Get a little smoky, wow, smoky flavor. That is a hot fire. Like there on a hot fire, that's all it takes. Just enough to soften it up and give it a little smoky flavor. Yeah, we're ready to serve those up. That is a fajita. What you got there, Bradley? Man, that looks nice. So you have your deer meat. Yep. You have your peppers. You have a fresh uh, lettuce and some cheese over the top of that and you're about to dig in. Yep, it looks awesome. Can you get it all together? I can, too much. Man, that smells awesome. <laughs> How is it? Worth all the work. Mm -hmm. Worth the hunt. This is when it really is all worthwhile, isn't it? Right mm -hmm. here. All right. So you see here, I have my lettuce, I have my cheese, and I have my deer meat, and my peppers and onions grilled properly and I'm just gonna I'm gonna dig right into that. It's always important to have the priority straight. Mm. Man that's good. Man oh man look at that. Mm. That is awesome. That is outstanding. Man, that is good. I want to say a special thanks to Bulldog Bill for uh, getting Daddy Hinkle's meat marinade. Um, he said it was a nice looking woman brought it into the establishment that he was in. I think he was cooking up some fish at the local pub and uh, she went out to her car and got this and brought it into him and said, give this a try. And I'll tell you, it's mild, isn't it? It is mild. It is excellent. Um, the only heat that we provided was with those uh, jalapenos. jalapenos. And that's not that bad, is it? I, mm -hmm. I can taste that little kick. But uh, just the meat flavor itself, just, just a chunk of this deer meat, just all by itself with that marinade, oh, tender man and flavorful it is so good special thanks to bulldog and special thanks to that yet late I don't know the lady's name but yeah uh, we will hook up for her we'll uh, we'll put a link to I think they have a website here yep daddyhinkles.com we'll put the link down below 
What do you think, Big Brad Brad? It's real good. Real good. All right, Bill Gaddy out. Thanks for watching. Bill Gaddy really out.